Hey guys, how's it going? Lunath here, and welcome back to another episode of my Kingdom Hearts Birth by Sleep Final Mix Let's Play series on the PlayStation 4. In the last episode we did the Dwarf Woodlands uh, for Aqua Storyline, where we basically helped out Snow White, and we fought the Magic Mirror boss. In this episode we're now going to go up here, and we're going to start doing the Enchanted Dominion, so let's visit this world. What's that? I think I'd better go take a look inside. Okay, let's just make our way all the way up to the castle. No idea if doing cartwheels is actually quicker than just normally running. I feel like it is, but probably not. Probably the same speed. Okay, we've got a bunch of these little enemies. See how much experience they give. It's always worth trying to find out if anything gives decent experience because, well, I don't want to. want to be optimal about trying to get some extra levels and stuff as we go where I can, I guess. These are all giving four experience each, which is nothing special. So let's just skip a few of them, and we'll go up these stairs. There's no way Tara would hurt somebody like that. You don't believe me? That's unfortunate, for he agreed so easily. He did? Ben, don't be fooled! Aqua! Terra would never do that. You know that as well as I do. Yeah. Ah, the truth can be most cruel, even amongst the closest of friends. After all, one never knows the secrets of another's heart. I'm sure you'll agree, Ventus. Aqua. The master sent me. Huh? Then, let's go home. But Terra... Terra's not ready to leave yet. <sighs> Sorry, Aqua. But... I can't go with you. What? It's just... I have to find him before it's too late. Ben! I see you too wield a Keyblade. How do you know about the Keyblade? A source of power. A key that opens the hearts of men, of entire worlds, and allows one to obtain anything and everything. Such a power I find most fascinating. So, Kara, he really? Yes. Now, my dear, would you like to assist me as well? Never! I see. Xehanort was right. You are a most stubborn girl. Master Xehanort, how do you... It seems you need time to consider my offer. Fortunately, I have the perfect place. What? Aqua. It looks like I was caught in a trap. Why are you here? To prevent me from breaking her evil curse, I was to meet the most beautiful girl at a cottage in the Glen. But now my true love lies in an eternal slumber, and only I can break the spell. You must really love her. Is what you said true? Yes. Maleficent told me. Oh, Prince Philip, it's you! Now, Philip, 
The road to true love may be barred by many more dangers, which you alone will have to face. I'm going with you. There's something I need to know, and Maleficent has the answer. Yes, of course, dear. Now come along. We must hurry to Aurora. Okay, let's get going, but first things first, let's grab this chest. Hopefully the map. It is the map, perfect. Uh, there's nothing else in here, let's just go. Uh, that's a dead end, we'll go this way up the stairs. I'll take out a couple of these guys, but I'm not going to kill them all, because, again, they're only worth full experience. Not really worth my time too much. Might as well skip them. Okay, looks like we're going to have to take out Maleficent's goons. Shouldn't be too difficult, although I want to prioritise the archers, I guess, because they'll be more annoying. Oh, that was a terrible thunder. That was a pretty pointless poison as well. That was relatively easy. Okay, um... Looks like we can either go this way or that's to the dungeon. I'm gonna go over here. This looks like a better way to go if I want to get out. Okay, so we're back to here. So if I just keep heading this way, then I hope we will get back out of the castle. All right, team up for Prince Philip. Open the gates and escape. And pretty straightforward. So how am I going to open the gate? I'm going to guess there'll be some levers or something I have to pull. Let's have a little look around. Might as well grab this chest. Cure. Ah, oh, I can't put it in my bars right now, but yeah, I want to have a cure on my bar, I think. It's always nice to have some way of healing. Especially when I like, cure with like, a kind of recharge. Like if a fight is a long fight, I can just... I can run around, dodge attacks, and just kind of heal up if I need to. I guess for now we just have to keep taking out these uh, goons. What do you want me to do? Oh, nice. Oh. Wait, I can climb up. I was about to jump back down. <laughs> okay, I don't want to fall off, I guess, so I'll just stick with attacks that will make sure I won't fall off. Like, spells don't make me charge forward or anything, so... Knock them down. Now, shoot your bow at me, I'll hit you with my keyblade. Okay, is there any more enemies up here? Oh, no, this is, yeah, whack that, and hopefully that should open the gate. And we can now go through. Okay, so I guess I kind of just got to clear the area so that he can then... Throw me up top somewhere and I can put a lever to open the gate. Get this 
these guys. Let's just run to the lever, or oh, it's not a lever, it's more of a wheel thing. Obtain high jump, should equip that, I guess, when I can. Edit loadout, replace jump with high jump. And let's also get a get you all my bars quickly. And we'll continue. Yeah. So let's see how high does I jump jump. Yeah, it does like a little flip. Because these are big guys, they're generally worth killing for experience. Yeah. Yeah. I leveled up again, some strength and defense. Defense is good, I'm not too worried about strength because I'm primarily focusing on magic on Aqua. I guess strength does help. I mean, I am still using the Keyblade a lot for attacks. Alright, let's, uh, oh, there's a chest over here. Let's grab that quickly. And got a high potion. And make our way through here. Let's open up this chest, and what do we get? We got an ether. I'm going to kill these two. Okay, I'm also going to kill those extra ones. These green guys give 8 experience now here, which is pretty decent. I mean, I guess it's double what the, uh, the greens gave. Okay, let's open this chest. We've got a balloon letter. Let's try and kill that one. Okay, let's use a thunder here. The Weaver is insane. Love it so much. Okay, let's open up this chest. Got another potion. Grab this chest, and I'll grab the little... Grab this as well. Got the flower sticker. Xehanort tell you. Such a pity, child, that you don't have Terra's gift for obedience. Nor can you see how easy it was for him. Terra would never do anything to help you. Quite the contrary. He fully embraced the darkness within himself. Stop lying! See for yourself all the powers of hell! <sighs> Okay, so we have to team up with Prince Philip and defeat Maleficent. Go 
her out. I think we should try and poison her to start with. I think if I go for uh, D-Link with Cinderella, this could be a pretty quick, easy fight. Let's try it. Oh, I can't D-Link here. Never mind then. Okay, I probably am not meant to be standing in all of this. I kind of want my cure to come off cooldown. I'm not exactly sure what's going on right now. I'm going to cure. And then I'll try and see if I can uh, hit her from behind. Oh, I can. Okay. I can't see her health bar, though. I assume I'm doing damage to her. Oh, wait. He wants me to go over and do stuff with him. No. I'm not a very good teammate, am I? <laughs> Uh, let me get my cure off again. Okay, when she finishes this, I'll go over to Prince Philip and try and actually do the game correctly. So, if I get to him, maybe. Wait, did he just tell me to come over here and then let me get burned? Is that his plan? Let's cure up. Oh. Thought I was going to get popped up a letter to, uh, like a button to press, but let's try it again. Oh, there we go. Yeah, I was going to press X. And I can just whack away. I fell off. Oh, maybe I'm meant to fall off. Thunder. Come on. Freeze. Oh, here. Grab on him. Okay, she's gonna fly around again. I'm gonna obviously have to get thrown back onto her again. Go. Okay, I think I'll just whack away now, finisher, sure, maybe? Come on. It's almost down. One more hit. One more hit. That's all I've got to do. There we go. I learned Firestorm. Might want to try try that out and see how it goes. No. All together, now sword of truth flies swift and sure that evil die and good endure. It's the power of true love that defeated you. I will not be defeated by something as insignificant as love. You don't even know the first thing about it. You're too clouded by darkness to see that there's something greater. Try all you want, but you'll never defeat a heart filled with light. Perhaps. But remember one thing. As long as there is light, 
there will be darkness. And in time, many more will be drawn to it. Then they will all belong to me! <laughs> Tara, you better stay strong for me. Here we got the fairy stars, the key blade that provides a balance boost in strength and magic. And we also got Exort Ex Exort Xehanort, Report 6. Okay, let's have a look at that new weapon quickly, see if it's any better than what I'm currently using. So I'm currently using the Stroke of Midnight, 2 Strength, 2 Magic. Treasure Trove is 3 Strength and 2 Magic. And the Fairy Stars is 2 Strength and 3 Magic, which is what I want. So let's equip that one. Equip it. Nice little upgrade. And then I think I'm going to save the game. And I'm going to probably do one more new save slot so I can have three in the go perfect well now that we've finished the enchanted dominion and I've saved the game I'm going to end this episode here so thank you guys for watching I hope you enjoyed please do comment like and subscribe and I will see you in the next one so see ya